Hi everyone and welcome back to the breakdown. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to download and install World Edit in Minecraft 1.16.4. I'm going to be going over every single step of getting World Edit from downloading it to installing it to setting it up. It's all going to be covered in this video and specifically we're going to be showing you how to get it in single player for Minecraft 1.16.4. If you want to get it on a multiplayer Minecraft server, this can be done using getting plugins. It's a little bit of a different like process because you need the server set up and all that. This is for single player, meaning like, you know, single player Minecraft worlds where you want to kind of do a build and then you can share that build other ways you could add that build to a server using schematics all that stuff but this is for your minecraft single player and world edit first foremost though we do have a smart sponsor which is apex minecraft hosting so if you do want to set up a server apex minecraft hosting will allow you to do that quickly and easily in just a few clicks we actually love apex so much that we host our own server played our breakdown craft.com on them and they allow you to host a server whether it's modded whether it's got plugins on it literally your options are almost endless however if you wanted to add world edit to a server apex allows you to set up a paper server and add plugins to that server very quickly and easily including plugins like world edit so that is an option as well if you don't want to add plugins to your server very easily so if you do want a server apex minecraft hosting is the only place to look it's very, very easy for your friends to play with you on an apex minecraft server so check out apex the first link down below the breakdown to xyz slash apex to start your very own minecraft server but nevertheless you are here to get world edit so let's go ahead and do it the first thing you want to do is go to the second link down below that's going to take you here this is our text tutorial for world edit some people say i go a little too fast in these tutorials we understand that so we do produce these uh these text tutorials here for you know you to go through at your own pace if i go too fast but nevertheless once you're here you want to go ahead and click on the green download world edit button that will then take us off to the world edit download page here where on the right hand side we just want to scroll down until we see minecraft 1.16 then under that we see world edit for forge for mc 1.16.3 slash 1.16.4 most mods for 1.16.3 are just natively compatible with 1.16.4 and world edit is the same however we do want to make sure that this is forge for mc 1.16.4 if you download like another version it's not going to work so make sure it does say forge in the title when you hover over it now let's go ahead and click on the purple download button the right of that there and it will take us off and the download will begin in a few seconds wait for it there it is the download is now beginning and in the bottom left we will need to keep this file as long as it says world edit forge we can go ahead and click keep on it on mozilla firefox you need to save it in the screen of your screen again as long as it says world edit forge we are good to save it and we aren't done just yet we still need to download forge which we do have conveniently linked as the third link down below and again this is our text tutorial with forge i'm gonna be walking through the basics of forge here but if you do have any issues this can help you out and on top of that, it is something you can go through at your own pace if I do go a bit too fast. But nevertheless, once you're here, go ahead and click on that green Download Forge button. That'll take us off to Forge's official website, where we want to make sure that MC 1.16.4 is selected. As you can see here, it's not. So what we want to do is go on the left-hand side, click on plus 1.16, and then click on 1.16.4. And then as you can see, it says MC 1.16.4, right like so. Then we want to come under Download Latest and click on the Installer button there. That'll then take us off to Add Focus, where stop! You don't want to click a single thing on this page. Do not click a single thing on this page except the red skip button in the top right that's the only thing you want to click here is the red skip button in the top right when you click on that in the bottom left forge 1.16.4 will download now you want to go ahead and click keep on that file and you have now downloaded forge however if you're on Mozilla firefox you want to save it in the screen of your screen and again don't click anything on this page except the red skip button in the top right nothing else except that red skip button and forge will download now let's go ahead and minimize our browser and here on our desktop we have forge and we have world edit if these aren't on your desktop no worries they're going to be found in your downloads folder to find that click the little windows icons in the top left of my screen probably in the bottom left of your screen click on that little windows icon in the top or bottom left of your screen then go ahead and type in downloads in this downloads file folder in windows click on that and then you can drag and drop forge and world edit from your desktop or from your downloads folder to your desktop right like so once you've got these on the desktop we can close out of the downloads folder and it's time to start getting world edit installed the first step of that is actually going to be forge so go ahead and right click on forge click on open with click on java and click ok however if you don't have java or if these files don't look like this they're not these java coffee cup logos well in that case what you need to do is download java for minecraft mods obviously world edit is a minecraft mod so we need to download java for it and this is the process for that it's a simple three-step process we just got this in-depth video that will help you get java downloaded and installed for minecraft mods now most people will then be able to open up forge but sometimes you won't be able to sometimes the java logos will still work look weird and stuff like that and in that case you need to run the jar fix and what this is going to do is take all the jar jars on your computer and link them up to java once again kind of linking them together and making them all work another quick and easy three-step process to get that done now we can go ahead and minimize our browser. We're going to right click on Forge, click on Open With, click on Java, and click OK, right like so. Then it's going to go ahead and open up the mod system install for Forge. 
just click on install client and click OK and it will go ahead download do everything it needs to do to get Forge installed again that was just click on install client and click OK and you're done it's that simple Forge doesn't make anything too complicated with that and then it installs itself and it says it's to installed client profile Forge version 1.16.4 awesome we can then go ahead and click OK and now it's time to get World Edit installed. This is actually pretty easy. So the first step is we want to go ahead and open up the Minecraft launcher. And before slamming that play button, we want to make sure that the Forge profile is selected. Now for me, it's automatically here. And it does say 1.16.4-Forge under it. So we can go ahead and click play. However, if this isn't selected here, just click this little arrow. Select it from this list. If it's not there though, no worries. Don't freak out. We've got a solution. Just click on installations at the top. And then click on this plus new button. Now you can name this whatever you want. I'm going to name it play.breakdowncraft.com. Why am I naming it that? Because that is our own incredible Minecraft 1.16.4 survival and skyblock server. We've got incredible greed protected survival with medieval survival having 30 custom quests and a player based economy. And aquatic survival has an awesome slash shot based economy. Our skyblock server has OP enchantments, custom tools, a custom island system. It is incredible. So go play with us over on play.breakdowncraft.com. Plus, skyblock is getting a huge update. Right? I'm a little like holding back on that because I don't want to spoil anything from our massive update that's coming. But nevertheless, play.breakdowncraft.com is the IP amazing survival and skyblock experience to so come play with us now we want to go ahead and click on the aversion drop down box here and then here you'll find release 1.16.4-forge mine's right up here to the top you might need to scroll down to find yours but again mine's right up here towards the top let's go ahead and click on that then we want to go ahead and change our resolution you don't have to do that but i'm doing that so you all can see once we get in game then click the green create button there and now down here at the bottom we have play.breakdowncraft.com it's 1.16.4-forge so we can go ahead and hover over that and click the green play button now it's going to go ahead kind of download do some things get forge set up and open up Forge right like so. Now, at this point, you might be like, I've installed Forge, but how do I install World Edit? Literally, it's clicking a few buttons and dragging and dropping at this point to get World Edit installed. The hard part of getting World Edit is done. That's being getting Forge. The easy part is actually installing World Edit at this point. So I'm going to go ahead, just let Minecraft open up, and I'll meet you on the main menu. So here we are on the Minecraft main menu. So once you're here, all you want to do is go on the Mods button here. And then in the bottom left, you have this Open Mods folder button. So again, click on the Mods button, and then click on the Open Mods folder button in the bottom left. They'll then open up your mods folder. Then all you want to do is take world edit and drag and drop it into your mods folder, right like so. And as long as it says world edit dash forge, you are good to go. It's it's installed. If it doesn't say forge here, go back to the beginning of the video and make sure you download the forge version of world edit. Now, if we come back in game, it's not going to be here. And it's never going to appear. You can click on mods tabs, click done, all that. It's not going to appear. What you need to do is quit the game. You then need to open up the Minecraft launcher, right like so. And then, once you open up the Minecraft launcher, you don't have to worry about creating a profile or anything like that. Now, just select the profile you create, in our case, play.breakdowncraft.com. It should say 1.16.4-Forge under it, and go ahead and click play. And now, Minecraft is going to open up with World Edit installed in it. We'll actually be able to see World Edit there. Did you see it for a second? There it is again. World Edit is recognized as a mod. That doesn't necessarily mean it's going to work, even though we know it's going to work. But that just means that the mod's there. It's recognized. It's loading. All of that stuff. So now it's going to go ahead, kind of reload things, bring it back to the center of the screen, and then it'll open up Minecraft with Optifine. Now, you saw it went non-responding there. That is normal. That happens. Don't freak out if it does, right? It's 100% normal for Minecraft to go not responding when it is opening up with mods. So don't take that, like, with any caution. That's 100% normal. Now, once we're on the Minecraft main menu, we can go ahead and click Mods here, and there is World Edit. I'm also going to go ahead and jump into our 1.16.4 test world and just show you that we can get a wand and use some of the world edit features. You may need to enable cheats on your world to use world edit, and if you don't have cheats enabled, I'm going to show you what to do. So once you're in game, if you don't have cheats enabled, just go ahead and hit escape and then click open to land and then click on allow cheats and then start land world. And now you can use cheats all you want. Specifically, you can do slash slash wand to get your world edit wand in your hand. Now we can do awesome stuff like let's turn this whole entire mountain here. And we'll just do this entire mountain into a block of like uh, gold. So we're going to turn all the stone to gold. So we'll do slash slash position one. Or we can use our world edit one to set our position one by left clicking. And then we can go over here, all the way over to here. And we're going to go ahead and go up in the air and do slash slash POS two, which is position two. And then we're going to go ahead and do slash slash replace. And we're going to do all of our stone with gold block. Boom. So there we go. So now we have a mountain of gold, literally. 
So cool stuff there. That's just one of the simple things you can do. We have our world edit schematics tutorial, which is kind of a little more in-depth process with world edit, but it shows you how to save, copy, move stuff using world edit and using schematics. For example, being able to take a schematic from one world to another world or from one server to another server for example. But nevertheless, there you have it. That is how you can download and install World Edit in Minecraft 1.16.4. If you have any questions, let us know in the comment section down below. Enjoy your new World Edit mod. It really is incredible. World Edit is something I recommend everyone, especially if you love building, get to know and use and all that stuff. So nevertheless, my name is Nick. This has been The Breakdown. Come play with us on play.breakdowncraft.com, the best Minecraft server in the multiverse. Again, we've got 1.16.4, Grief Protected Survival, Custom Skyblock. It's amazing. You will love it. So come play with us. Play.breakdowncraft.com is the IP. But nevertheless, can't wait to see you online. My name is Nick. This has been The Breakdown, and I am out. Peace.